Hello and welcome to ICT with Miss P. Lately I've been really thinking about charts. I mean hey, who doesn't love a good chart? Charts are commonly used to display data in a pleasing way that makes it easy to read and understand. Charts and graphs can show many things just like this, or this, or even this. These charts and graphs are all well and good, but where is the chart that plans and tracks my project I hear you ask? Enter stage right. Henry Lawrence Gant, a mechanical engineer, management consultant and industry advisor born in 1861. He developed Gant charts in the second decade of the 20th century as a visual tool to show scheduled and actual progress of projects. Accepted as a commonplace project management tool today, it was quite a radical concept and an innovation of worldwide importance in the 1920s. Gant charts were first used on large construction projects like the Hoover Dam, started in 1931. Before starting a project, businesses create a Gantt chart to plan what they're going to do over the coming weeks. Spreadsheets are a good tool to help create a Gantt chart. This is a Gantt chart depicting a project to build a house. Can you see anything wrong with the plan? You have been watching ICT with Miss P.